Hi my lovelies, I hope you're all well. So today we are in Windows and I'm gonna show you how you can upload SVG files to Design Space on Windows. So first thing we're going to do is go to our three bars and we're going to open up our canvas and then we're going to go to Upload. We're going to download an SVG folder like so. Sometimes they'll come in and you can open up the folder, sometimes depending on your computer and your uh, the windows that you're running from, you'll need to unzip them. And I'm running from an older windows today to actually show you how you can unzip files. So all I'm gonna do is double click it. I'm going to select the SVG folder, select extract. I'm just gonna select it to extract to my downloads and select OK and this will then unzip it for me. Depending on your windows and what you're running from, the unzip process may just be that you just double click it and it automatically unzips. Sometimes you'll have a unzip program that you have to unzip with. They're all really simple and easy to use. If I go to my downloads and I select the folder and open it up, you can see I've got all of the images. And I find, especially if I'm doing lots of downloading, when I've got folders, I just find it can be really confusing trying to open them from design space because you need to go through and find them and it, it can be a bit of a rigmarole. So what I do is go into the folder, hold down my shift key, select them all using my arrow key, and then I just drag and drop them to my pictures so that they're all in my pictures folder and they're easy for me to find. If I then go to upload image and browse, I can then select the SVG, select open. Because it's an SVG, there's no of the background removal step, so it will come in like this and it will always keep it as a cut image. I can of course change it to a PNG, but with an SVG, it will always come in as a cut image and there's no background to remove because it's a multi-layer image. I can give it a name, so let's call it flag SVG and a tag, which is always super helpful when you're uploading lots and lots of images because you'll never ever remember the image names. And upload. I can then select it, add to my canvas, Always make sure if you're gonna resize it that you put the lock on, and then I can resize it to make it more manageable to work with. And this SVG has come in really skew with, so I might have to play with it, but you can see all the different layers there. So I can then ungroup it, and I can work with all my layers and do all the things that I need to do with them. As always, thank you so much for joining me. I upload every Monday, Wednesday and Friday at 7pm. If you've got any comments or questions, please do leave them below. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell and I will see you all very soon. Bye!